I was gonna go out and one second, I'm gonna put this in my tripod. That's better. I was gonna go out and apply to a few places, like give them my resume, but um, my parents seem very busy today, so I don't think I'm gonna ask. That, and I'm not really feeling motivated to do anything today. I've literally, I did all the stuff before this clip, and that drawing, and that's literally all I've done today. Not really sure about anything else. There's a bird outside and it's being annoying. So I'll check in if I end up doing anything else. Probably not though. You were wondering what the uh, sound is? The bird sound? Kinda confused. Kinda not. Kinda don't care. Me too. I was thinking maybe playing my ukulele a little bit, but that means I would have to tune it and all that stuff and find all the chords that go with the songs and that is just too much effort and friggin yeah maybe I'll watch Netflix probably Hannibal or something also my hair is a disaster it's because I literally haven't done anything with it today so I just made some uh, raspberry and mint infused water and then I'm gonna see if I can like, make this mint grow and root so I can just plant it and then have a freaking constant source of mint accomplishment <laughs> I made an accidental pun. I said accomplish mints. Ha! I'm hilarious. Putting the groceries away. Woo! You're scaring the poor cat. <laughs> what is these two over here? I don't know what they're doing. So as you can see, I literally just made a mess. I made a whole bunch of like breakfast wraps. That is not the freezer. No, not a bunch, but a few breakfast wraps. <laughs> they're really good, so I'm pleased. I bowled some cantaloupe. I need to put that in the fridge. And I'm going to do soy milk. My evening has been productive, I think. I just made my coffee for tomorrow. Um, the French press I got in my last vlog, my, yeah, my last vlog. I put a bag over it because I don't want it to spill over because I can't, this doesn't fit on it. So yeah. It's like 10 a.m. ish and I literally just woke up. Why do I hear a child screaming? No one's supposed to be home. <laughs> okay, so my hair is fucking gross. And I washed it on like Saturday. So I need to fucking have a fucking shower. I don't really want to have a shower, but I need to. Fucking scared me. Why? I didn't know you were home. Oh. I was bringing this down as a weapon. Santa, Santa. Oh my god. Sorry. All I hear was like fucking weird ass sounds and I'm like, am I gonna have to defend myself? I've literally gotten nothing done today. Also I'm sitting on my bathroom floor and I don't really know why. chiropractor's appointment tonight and then I'm going to hopefully drop a resume off at the store that my mom suggested that I apply at so that will be basically the only productive thing I do today other than edit this video and take a shower which I've already done my hair looks very curly like usual so yeah oh yeah also I made some um I made some more of the coffee and got a few like mason jars and stuff and put leftover tea in it and leftover coffee so yeah that's about it so let's look at this and let's look and see what we're looking for so firstly I drew a line straight down through your spine I want every bone to line up on that the left side is quite a bit higher than the right side Throws your body off kilter a little bit there. Your spine should be. The green line shows us where your spine actually is. 
pretty close. Are you going to line up on there? Do you think it is? <laughs> no. So where's the problem? Uh, it looks like pretty much everywhere. <laughs> no, just the bones are off center here to the left again. So we have a bit what's called a scoliosis there. It doesn't matter too much for your overall health, but it really matters to me because seeing that helps us when we want to do adjustments within your spine, helps us to make sure they're correct for you, mm -hmm. not for your mom, not for somebody else down the street. Wants yeah. They work exactly for you. And finally, your neck from the side. <coughs> Pardon me. So again, this blue line is what we'd like to see. So your neck and your head is really way too far forward for you. Um, in fact, probably two to three inches forward. I have to adjust these areas to get that to come back. And the nerves from here, they go up and supply structures up in your head. So, and where does depression, anxiety, those things usually originate from? Somewhere up here. So if those nerves aren't working properly, they can certainly affect areas higher up as well. So that's what you look like when we take away the muscles. It's okay. And the skin, <laughs> see what the bone structure is. It's a fancy dancy process. <laughs>adjusted for the first time i have to go in three times a week for six weeks i think it is. six six weeks i think it is so that'll be exciting we booked another like a doctor's appointment sometime next week i believe and yeah other than that that's 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 all i know about right now i'll probably just edit this video and then end up watching like something on Netflix because that is basically what my life consists of is just watching stuff on Netflix and editing. This will probably be like the last like thing I do um will record. My arm is hurting. There we go. My fingers in the way. There you go. I keep looking at the screen. This will probably be the last thing that I record uh today because probably nothing else is gonna go on. I made myself coffee with Dude. which is not the best idea in existence. Um, oh yeah, I forgot, but like, I don't know if, it, if, if I got it on camera or like if I got some audio or technically something of him saying it. Uh, basically, I have like minor scoliosis, uh, which if you don't know, basically just makes the spine like kind of, uh, bent, I guess. Probably from school and just looking down at my phone because I'm a teenager and various other things. Um, sleeping on your stomach can affect it too, apparently, which I used to do a lot. So... Yeah, that's, that's the verdict there.